evening. Pretty good. Yeah. I am really taken back by this event. Well, yeah, this is our ninth annual, so it's been the, this is the ninth year. Um, basically, when we started as a club in 2003, we decided we were going to have a track uh, track meet every year, and it has doubled the amount of participants from 2004 to to um, to right now. So we are just really ecstatic about the turnout, the attendance, the over 1,200 athletes that are here, the fan support. Uh, we're just excited about what's happening today. It's just amazing. I, and I'm really excited for you with this because after many events, this has really been an outstanding performance as far as athletes as well as participants and fans who are here. Yes. What about our athletes and you focusing on them as for Club Monica? What do you have plans for them? Well, we always have plans, you know, it's basically right now seeing where they're at at this particular meet, fine-tuning them for March, which is basically where we're going to begin to do our peaking toward the Crypto Games. And we're just going to see how we are and what we need to work on for the next couple of weeks, carrying toward um, Crypto Trials, qualifying for the Crypto Games in Hamilton, Bermuda, um, participating uh, tremendously well in the um, Crypto Games. Going into, into tomorrow, uh, I know where we're at right now with the heats. Um, do you have any athletes so far that you see that have broken the records tonight that you think are going to be hopefuls for the Rifter? Well, no, we haven't had the finals as yet. We've just been doing the preliminary rounds. So in about maybe about 30 minutes or so, we'll see some finals in the hurdles and the finals of the 100 meters and the 400 meters. So we're just waiting for that to happen because this is the first time of the year where we're going to see the best of the best in each age category competing against one another. We're taking the top eight finals um, times to the finals and, you know, people are going to wait around for those events, no matter how late it is. <laughs> one final question. As far as some positive thing that's coming out of Club Monaco, what are some of those things that you want to leave with our viewers as well as readers? Well, you know, we want to produce fine young men and women. That's our primary goal. Um, learning discipline and determination through athletics is what, our, what we're all about. So basically producing fine young men and women who can make a contribution to the Bahamian society. You know, we, we hear in the news all the time about how our young people are, you know, doing this, doing that. Look around, we have t over 1,200 athletes here today. And we know that, you know, the youth are not as bad as they say they are. We have some really great youth um, in the Bahamas, and they're doing extremely well. Well, thank you on behalf of Bahamas Athletics. Thank you very much.